another night of unrest and I want to know where are the brave people? That is, where are the people who should be speaking out for the beleaguered and the ignored? And I'm talking about the members of parliament who belong to this party that calls itself the Labour Party, which seems to have turned into the Keir Starmer Party. I'm Granny Opterix and I'm on YouTube, Rumble, BitChute and Minds. We are supposed to have representatives who look after our interests and go to Parliament to um, further our interests, the interests of the constituencies. We're not hearing them speaking out, are we? And we're not hearing newspapers speaking out either. Tony Randall some, some, suns himself at a five-star hotel in Cyprus. Now, this is too coincidental to be just a coincidence. He's talking, the newspaper here is talking about Tony Randall, who uh, is away on holiday. And then you get Keir Starmer saying something like this. Thuggery we've seen this weekend be in no doubt those that have participated in this violence will face the full force of the law. The police will be making arrests, individuals will be held on remand, charges will follow and convictions will follow. I guarantee you will regret taking part in this disorder, whether directly or those whipping up this action online and then running away themselves. Right. Do you see that? He's talking about Tony Randall there. And that's obvious, it's very obvious that he's been speaking to the newspapers and he's been saying, well, all the media, and he's been saying, if you don't tow the line, you're not going to get any more interviews. So the newspapers are running this sort of thing. And it's all the same, not just the Daily Mail. They're running this sort of thing because they want to hang on to their jobs. And where are the, uh, where are the, the members of parliament who are supposed to be representing these people? I'm not talking about the vandals. Obviously, there are going to be vandals taking uh, advantage of any situation of unrest. It happens all over. But where are the members of parliament who are supposed to be representing the ordinary people, the, the, the people who are just concerned about their daughters at summer camp, uh, their, uh, well, about their children at summer camp, about their daughters just being able to walk out in the streets uh, and, and, talk, and meet friends. Where are the representatives for these people? No, they are all hanging on to their jobs by um, not contradicting this guy. We have now a dictatorship. We are at the moment in a situation of civil unrest in this country. This is sort of unusual by British standards. But what's even more unusual is the epidemic of cowardice, which is completely overtaking all our responsible organs of um, government and information. And that is absolutely shameful. Till next time. You can help my channel by clicking like, by subscribing, by clicking the notification bell and by sharing if you're so inclined. Links to my other channels are in the description, also links to donation sites, but really the best way you can help me is simply by clicking like. Thank you.